What's up? All right. So, Nicole and Kai have gone to the movies this morning. And so, I am working on a project that might be the project that I've been wanting to do the most. And uh, we've been getting stuff ready here at the Campbell Homestead. And we ran some underground electrical to mom and dad's camper. Um, we're still going through the whole process to get everything set up for their house. We'll be sharing some more about that with y'all. It's been a little bit of a headache and some run around that we're still working through to get all the everything we need. It, when you go through county government, it, it's, it can be an ordeal. But we're working on that. We'll tell y'all more about that. But this morning, I'm working on a project that I am very excited about very excited about and I wanted to show it to you so part of what we have here is our own little chicken coop but it needs a door and I've gotten an automatic door that raises and lowers with the sun. Chickens go in and out. But the only problem, it's a little narrow. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of modifying to make it work, but we can make that happen. So that is what I'm working on this morning. And I am excited to get some chickens. See how good it fits. Oh, we got us a gap. I knew better than that. Campbell, you knew better than that. All right, let's do this. Let's do this so we get it good and snug. Should have done this the first time, but. I was being a little lazy. All right, nine and 15 sixteenths. Same on that side. Let's see if this fits a little better now. Much better. Much, much, much better. Should have done that the first time, Campbell. difficulty and um, I videoed putting the screws in and the boards up and everything and got everything in and I realized my camera had shut off because I had run out of memory on the SD card so um, had to go inside and make some room and I don't know about y'all but for some reason I always got to learn things the hard way I don't know I guess that's life but anyways let's put this door up And there she is, folks. Now, let's see. Now, when we turn this on, if this works right, this door should raise up. Here we go. Moment of truth. Flip. do that. 
All right. There's a little gear back there behind it that runs it, and it doesn't stick far through these holes. So, got it in there a little better. Let's see. Moment of truth again. <laughs> okay. Third attempt. I got it to go up, but then it was hitting this lip here. There's a little lip there start, so I had to put some boards in behind it. Third attempt. Let's see. I don't know. I refuse to let this chicken door get the better of me. All right, so I realized I took it inside, and when I laid it flat on the table, um, it opened just fine. And I think on the back, what it is is these little plastic pieces have to be sitting down to hold this door snug because this wheel the cogs just skip if they don't hold it in so luckily there was some old pieces of trim sitting here and so what I did I built a frame around it so hopefully it'll sit flush all the way around and hold it tight and secure in there so let's try this one more time Okay, y'all. All this for this chicken door. So, I realized it needed some pressure back here pushing against the door. So, final try. Let's see if we got it. We put these little boards in to hold the door flat against it. Here we go. Hey! Looky there. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. You know, it really is the simple things in life. And I am excited to get some chickens. I just dropped Gaines off. I got a message from the post office this morning at 2 a.m. saying that our chickens were ready to pick up. So it's 7.02 now, and I just <coughs> wanted to see if I could come get them early because technically it's not open till 9, but you know, they're open in the back. And um, you can hear them. Can you guys hear them? go home and I'm sure they're so hungry and thirsty so oh, I'll keep you updated all right we made it home they just stopped chirping it's like they knew they got quiet so strange so strange so we're gonna take them inside and introduce them to to Ryan and and Kai Kai you ready baby Just ignore our box of burning. Sharper, Sharper, you're gonna wake up high. Oh. Look, there he is. Hey everybody, look. They all quieted when I pulled into the driveway. It was like that you. So there's some stuff to put in there. 
So as you saw a little clip, we got the chickens today. Um, just wanted to talk through real quick some of the things that we're doing for our babies. Uh, first off, we have this heat lamp. They like it between 85 and 95 degrees. So right now it's about 73, so they're probably pretty chilly. I'm feeling great, but they're probably pretty chilly. Um, so we have that. And then we have this, which I believe I'm this not gonna use is that a yet. feeder. I want to use feeder. that. Yeah. Yeah. That's also a feeder. That's the this water. is our water, yeah. and um, it has these little plastic rings on here. You can also put rocks in here, but you don't want your chicks to drown. So we have these um, this feeder so that they don't like drown themselves. And then this here is for their food, and um, again they. This is smooth up here so they don't try to perch on here and poop in their food. Um, and then we have pine a here pine because we've heard right that the pine, um, pine is better than the cedar. The it's cedar might right make them sick. We don't know, but we're just saying, okay, let's do the pine, right? Yeah. Here um, is a gallon of the hydro, this hydro hen which is a supplement and it has probiotics, electrolytes, and acetaminophens, whatever that is. Um, but this is crucial to them because they've been in a vehicle so driving fun. from Minnesota for yeah, the past three days. So they're super chickens hungry. chickens came from Minnesota. So we're gonna um, crack it open in a minute and see who's left. And then we're going to put them in their house. Right, you ready to pull it off? Yeah. You want to see the chickens? You open it up, Kai Kai. <gasps> Move it out the way. Open it up. Pull it all the way out. <gasps> there they are. Hey, Kai. I'm going to pick it up, Daddy. Yeah, we can pick it up. Pick it up. I'm going to pick one up. Daddy. You want to pick one up? Is it okay if I put it's okay. It's okay, Chicken. It's going to be okay. Now we realize we thought we had food for them, but we don't have food. They're already starting to peck each other. Look at that. Chickens do establish a pecking order. But only so when they're very crowded. Right, they have they to, uh, peck each other. Yep. And they are very crowded. Oh, his eyes just opened up. i show them how to drink. You gotta take their beak and put it in there. I did already. I'll do a couple more. Come here. Come here, Tweety. Come on. I will, I will get one. I will get one. Teach you how to drink. There you go. 
Good job. Good job. You did it. The you did it. one. Now they're all checking out what's going on. Look at him. He's like, oh yeah. Hey, big one too. <laughs> I don't think he opened his mouth. Well, that other one didn't want him to get in. Put it over there in that cooler yeah. corner. No, it's not a cooler corner. Y'all come and you get it. You gotta teach them. Watch, let's see if they figure it out on their own. There was one in here. Yep, oh, there goes one. Oh, he figured it out. Now look at him. Oh, look. Didn't even have to teach them. <laughs> They're so hungry. They're like, give me the food. <laughs> this guy is just like right on top. Oh, his eyes, her eyes got real big. <laughs> they were closed. <laughs> They're stuck. They can't eat their food. Chickens. And we got some chicken starter growth. So it says it's got 20% protein. It's got the prebiotics and the probiotics. Let us know in the comments what y'all use for chicken starter food. <laughs> if this is pretty good stuff. We're, we're still learning a lot about the chickens. So let us know what you like to use or don't like to use. Hi. You give them trash. <laughs> yeah, let us know because we're, we're learning. What do you think, Kai? Do you love your chickens? I just want to put that in there for chickens. They can't eat it. Why? That's not for them to eat because that's trash. That's just plastic. Enjoy your breakfast, babies. Enjoy your breakfast. Hey, Gaines. Hey. What you doing? I'm just sitting here. You're going to have to get used to this if you live here. Yeah, we live out where people like to shoot guns. Now, one time at my birthday when we were leaving, there was a guy shooting a shotgun and it sounded like <laughs> Just like that, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, so here's your chickens. I'm going to pick one up. Okay. I'll pick uh, this one. Oh, 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 Which oh. one is that one? I think this is Valkyrie. That's Valkyrie. Is Valkyrie your favorite? No, all of them are my favorite. They're all your favorite. Oh, okay. We got Valkyrie Campbell right here. Oh. Oh, they are so cute. They are. They're doing really good, aren't they? Yeah, they're skittish though. They run really fast. They do. It's like they don't like being picked up, and then as soon as you pick it, pick them up, it's like they do like it. You gotta bond with them. Yeah, you gotta bond with them. And we love our chickens so much. Yep, we do. We're gonna raise them really good. Yep, I hope they make a lot of eggs. Yep. So cute, Daddy. <laughs> I love him. 